Hello, hello again, Pickles. I bet y'all, I'm being, I bet y'all are wondering where I've been. After that nosebleed situation and all the throwing up I did last week, I just decided to take Sunday off and just relax and decompress. But I was actually uh, back in my live stream on Sunday. So if you caught that, good for you. If you didn't, don't worry, it'll be back on YouTube as always. I just woke up, I sit up till 5 a.m. because Nick and I took an all day nap from three to eight. Um, so I dealt with Jasmine a little bit, made some food, stayed up till five, watched TV, blah, 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 blah. Now, um, I just saw on Instagram like this recipe for sliders and I want to make it. So I'm going to go out there, say hi to Jasmine, Nick and everything and go make those sliders. I'm very excited. Y'all can watch this process with me. I've been a lot more hydrated lately. I haven't been throwing up as much and I haven't been nearly as nauseous or crampy. So super happy about that, but I can definitely feel my stomach growing every day. Um, I should be showing in a couple of weeks, so stay tuned for that. <clears throat> How are you? Hello? The pickles say hello. Hello? She likes tartar sauce with her chicken nuggets. I know it's weird to say, but... She's, she's, been, ask, she's been asking me for dang hot sauce all morning. Really? You like hot sauce? Mm -hmm. She's like, mm-hmm. I got a You know she just wants to watch her little shows. How have you been this morning? Pretty good. That's chilling. Cleaning up, sleeping up. I couldn't see the last night. Yeah, the house looks really nice. Well, you still slept for a while. You slept from like almost one to five, and then I fell asleep. And the tree's on again. Yeah, <laughs> the tree you didn't even want to put on. The tree you didn't even want to put up. The tree you argued with me about for weeks, and you keep putting it on. I love it. Jasmine. I love you. Vibe. I know, I love it. Everything looks really good. I'm gonna help you with this laundry and stuff. I'm preheating the oven so I can make these chicken sliders. Chicken sliders, beef sliders. They're supposed to be mini hamburgers and Nick loves hamburgers. So I'm gonna use these puppies, some cheese and beef and stuff. So we will see. And Nick's got his food cooking. Don't forget to put the lid on that when, you're, when you drop food. Oh. Not you overcooking them. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, Pickles, so according to the recipe, you gotta cut the bread, cut it all together as one, don't separate them. Then throw the meat in the skillet, which is warm now. I'm gonna season the meat with um, regular seasonings, salt, pepper, garlic, and stuff, paprika, blah, blah, blah. And then add onions into it as well. Alrighty, Pickles, so uh, according to the Instagram recipe I'm using, um, I browned up the meat, seasoned it, added onions, Ketchup, mayo, and uh, mayonnaise, or what's it called, mustard. I've spread the meat here, and now I'm gonna continue adding more cheese on top. There's cheese under, as you can see, and I did mayo on this bread. Lady in the video says, make sure you get it very cheesy. Every inch of it. And then we're gonna throw it in the oven for a little bit, and then glaze the bread with some butter gonna be a should be a hit okay so we will see I'm nervous this looks like the extra meat so didn't really fit Just trying to cheese up these edges a little bit. Okay. So now I'm going to put the lid on it. And throw it in the oven. I'm going in at 350. Just till the cheese melts. So now at this point, Pickles, we just wait. First time making this recipe, hopefully it's good. Now I need to tidy up the kitchen because Nick just cleaned last night. I don't want him to see this. Oh, Lord.
and go ask daddy for whatever you need. I love you, princess. We're watching the family Chantel right now. A little bit of a guilty pleasure reality TV show. No playing in the trash. Put it back. Jasmine, put it back. That's trash. Go to daddy. I love you. Good job not going pee pee in your bed last night without a diaper. We are still finishing up potty training, Jasmine. We need to get her some bigger underwear this Christmas so that she can officially start pulling down her pants and everything. It's super exciting to think like, wow, my big girl's out of diapers and we're gonna be drowning in more diapers for the next two years, yay. Three, actually, if you include all of these months, I'm sitting here in bed rest. Cause she said water, she was thirsty. Oh. She wants some drink, okay, okay. Nick and I just woke up from our midday nap and uh, it was good, a little bit longer than I expected, but we were just waiting on some Amazon packages and now they're here. Nick's Christmas presents. It's not even December yet and he has his Christmas presents already because Nick's the type of guy who wants them now, 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 now. He's smirking over there. Hi, hey, baby. I'm going to put your toys in your room. So Jasmine just got her toys off lying about and she was using her bathroom trash her bathroom in here which is good she's got pee pee in the toilet which is good that means she did not pee pee in the bed or pee pee on the floor i'm gonna go charge your tablet i gotta charge your tablet okay so I'm gonna go put this on the charger and make Jasmine a little snack because she keeps saying, eat, eat, eat. She's hungies. So we'll make sure that gets taken care of. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get this bed a little bit. over here I'm still watching the family Chantel here and binge watching it after seeing a YouTube compilation of like the breakup and um yeah I just want to get this bed made up so the room looks a little better My throat's a little dry. I don't know if it's because I've been coughing a lot, packing up extra mucus, or because I was asleep all day so I didn't get to drink much water. But earlier I was in the kitchen trying to make some food, hamburger sliders to be exact, and I started feeling really dizzy and lightheaded. And I threw up immediately. And then I just stayed in the bed after that because I didn't want to risk it. With me being pregnant with twins, it is also a high risk pregnancy, so the doctor may suggest bed rest soon, but I'm already suggesting bed rest for myself and trying to relax as much as possible because instead of making one baby, I'm making two and I'm trying to make sure that I'm staying as comfortable and, you know, comfortable and unstressed as possible. So I've been trying to work a little less. I applied for WIC and I have a WIC appointment in December. So I'll wait on that. My parents just went out of town to Jamaica. Good for them. They texted me that they touched down, so that's good. And now I'm about to take these blankets to Jasmine's room. She only has one blanket on the bed right now. I'm just gonna make sure she's got plenty. Okay. <laughs> Jasmine, you wanna put more ornaments on this tree? Gigi says the tree's not decorated if you can still see the tree. Mm -hmm. Sounds like hating. Yeah, I'm making you some noodles. Noodles coming up.
I'm just waiting on these noodles to start getting warm. So you can see some of these are the Asian noodles and then these are the regular ramen noodles. It's got a little bit of a texture difference. But Jasmine loves ramen noodles, so it's okay. I am starting to show a little bit for those of y'all concerned. I can really see over there, but bump date coming soon. A bump date coming soon near you. Just trying to make sure all these noodles get submerged in this one. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm working on it. Jasmine. Here you go. Thank you. satisfied. Sit down. Well, I finally finished those noodles up for Jasmine and Nick. If you want some, you can have some. There's a little bit of a bump there. I don't know if y'all can see it. A bit of a curvature. And, um, yeah, I'm just making sure these twins are growing healthily and happily inside of me. And, uh, Jasmine has a doctor's appointment tomorrow at 1 p.m., and then I have a doctor's appointment on the 4th, and then I have another doctor's appointment on the 14th, and then Christmas, so. <laughs> Weeks of appointments coming up, but knock them out, see how the babies are doing, and then have a great Christmas. Then after Christmas, we should find out the genders. Fingers crossed, super excited. Um, we were going to do the NIPT testing or whatever to find out the genders through blood, but I'd rather just wait till it's free. But it's two babies, so it's going to be hard to see. I'm guessing two girls. What do y'all think I'm having in the comments? Um, sorry I'm being so low vibrational, but if you've got this far in the video, I want you to put your opinion on what you think I have in the comments now. I think I'm having two girls because I'm carrying kind of low. I've been a little bit overly sick, and I heard those are common with female pregnancies. Um, female baby pregnancies, and boys are usually a bit higher, and I don't feel anything high up. So we will see. Jasmine was pretty low down when she was in me, and it's just crazy to think one of them went like... I used to not know what Jasmine looked like. I used to only know that she was there. Then we got her 3D picture and we saw just a glimpse of her and it was like hard to imagine that on a human person. And then she came out and it was like, oh, there she is. So it's just the same thing with these swims and it's kind of scary. Like, <laughs> they're coming any day now. I'm about 12 and a half weeks. Um, I'm about to be out of my first trimester very soon, which is exciting because that means the nausea will subside. I did throw up earlier, but it was really just mostly bile. And I think it's because I was eating like cold, warmed up microwave food so yeah we'll just see i'm gonna keep hydrating keep taking care of myself and if you pickles have any questions for me and my pregnancy please make sure to leave those in the comments so i can answer them um i took off my ring when i was in jasmine's room um and then she moved them around so i had to clean her room to find them but found them so it's all good uh now i'm just relaxing i can walk around the house now i'm not really feeling as lightheaded or nauseous as i was earlier so uh, maybe it was just a momentary thing oh but i am a little tired so uh, i want to hop back on fortnite so we'll see bye pickles 
I'll see y'all on the flip and thanks for tuning into my pregnancy. I'm the type of person who likes watching people vlog, especially if they're like boring, low quality, like not low quality, but low key vlogs. Um, or just watching vlogs about people that I'm interested in, watching vlogs about things I'm interested in. So for instance, twin pregnancies, I would go watch twin pregnancy vloggers. There's only a couple that still, you know, do it because it's like once they have the twins, they realize how much work it is and then they stop vlogging. And I think it's funny. It's kind of like a pattern I've seen. But there's also so many that are, you know, interesting and so many that are not really. So I don't know. I'm just chilling. Hopefully y'all enjoy me being a twin pregnancy vlogger. And it's so funny because back in August, one of the prickles predicted that I was having twins. She said, you have very good energy and he am seeing twins and i was like whoa don't put that negativity on me and then i ended up pregnant with twins so that was funny my granny told me that there's twins in our family and nick's dad has twins on both of his side of the family I'm like y'all didn't think to tell me none of this fake but it's all good that just doubles the chances of jasmine having twins in the future if she wants or any daughters we may have so exciting maybe not exciting i don't know how they feel but yeah thank you pickles for tuning in and i hope you're uh, comfortable along this journey with me Sorry I haven't been live as much, but you can always catch up on my content here on YouTube. Oops, I'm back. I actually forgot to mention to you guys. So, Nick fell asleep before me. Shocker. He always takes one or two midday naps. Um, He's more of a night owl these days. And he's been uninspired making YouTube videos, so he's just been chilling. Um, he decided to clean the whole house yesterday. So, I decided to make up a reward system for when he cleans something, he will get paid a dollar two dollars or three dollars and this will accumulate so that he can get his gun parts that he likes getting and i can have the house stay clean because he's been struggling to keep the house clean because he sees me not doing anything and feels unmotivated because we usually clean together so i figured money will motivate him but i'm not like oh ten dollars to clean the toilet it's like a dollar you know for little things like if he fills up my water bottle which he's done right now he just earned 50 cents so i'm gonna put 50 cents in his savings account and then let's say he does five things for me in the next two days he can earn like up to ten dollars and then he can buy a gun trinket that he wants or he can continue saving for the next couple of days and then get a new or more expensive gun trinket so i came up with this system because when my parents were growing were raising us we had like a system where you could put like stars on your calendar when you had like a good day and then you could exchange the stars at the end of the week for something so i figured nick's love language is words of affirmation so i figured if he could get his favorite thing gun parts and or guns um as well as he cleans the house work therefore i can give him words of affirmation of like thank you and i appreciate it blah 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 it all works hand in hand so we're going to be trying out this process the next couple of weeks um you know nick doesn't have any real source of income so this will be like a valid reasoning for him to be pulling money out of the savings account even though we don't have much yet yet we just need to wait for his youtube channel to get monetized and for him to blow up or whatever but my youtube channel has been doing slightly better i don't know if it's just the day or if it's going on an upward trend but i have to wait for more analytics to actually see what's going on but as of right now we're just trying to make ends meet um i did get a refund from one of my amazon products that i didn't get so that's cool because it's like get the money back but as of right now i'm just trying to make sure nick stays motivated and he stays busy and he has a reason to get out of bed. So that's exciting. Um, I think he's interested in the process. He just filled up my water bottle for 50 cents. And he can do that. If he fills up my water bottle five times a day, he just earned 250. You know what I'm saying? So he hates filling up my water bottle for me. <laughs> he gets so tired of filling ice up and getting the ice for me. Uh, especially since I always want extra ice. So I figured, you know what? Well, if you do it five times, you just got $2.50. And then you can clean the bathroom for $3 and clean our room for $3. And boom, now you have $10. You know what I'm saying? So... Um, I think it'll be a good system. I would love a system like this. I don't get paid when I clean the house. You know what I'm saying? I clean the house for free. <laughs> um, I, I work. So we will see. We are 3,000 subs away from getting monetized for Nick approximately. So we just got to wait that it's out. The hours, it's the watch hours. Yeah, true. But we'll see. I just wanted to fill you guys in that I made that. So I made the chore list or whatever while he was sleeping. And, um... I think it'll work over the next week or so, but I, it's just a trial. We're doing it a trial for a week. We're going to see how he does. And um, Jasmine's bringing the noodles. Thank you. I was thinking about those noodles. Hey, go. Thank you. Hey, yeah, so we are going to just see how it goes. And there's even stuff like if you cook a meal, you get five. Like doing harder stuff gets you more money. You know what I'm saying? One dollar, two dollars, three dollars, even five dollar items on there. So he can't do everything every day. Like he can't do the dishes. And then do the dishes the next day. And there's only two dishes in the sink and get $5. He has to wait three days 
for the dishes one to reaccumulate. So, we'll see. Love you, pickles. Tell me you love them. Love you.